the tube light is connected to the mains directly and uh, its brightness is directly proportional to the magnitude of the applied voltage when we have V is equal to 0 we have a dim tube light and when we have V max or minus V max that is the uh, magnitude of the voltage is maximum we have peak brightness so in India uh, UK and China where we have 50 Hertz we have 50 cycles in one second so one cycle is of 20 milliseconds and in one cycle of voltage we get two cycles of the light going from dim to bright means two cycles of brightness uh, note that when we have V is equal to 0 the brightness is uh, very near to 0 but it's not exactly 0 since the tube light does not instantly switch off and its brightness does not instantly go to 0 when we have Vmax the tube light is very bright then again we have V is equal to 0 the tube light is dim and then we have minus V max, the tube light is again very bright. So we note that in one cycle of voltage, we get two cycles of brightness. And one cycle of voltage is 20 milliseconds, so one cycle of brightness is of 10 milliseconds. So in one second, we have 50 such cycles of voltage, and uh, one cycle of voltage has two cycles of brightness. So in one second, if we have 50 cycles of voltage, we would have 100 cycles of the brightness and the light would go from dim to bright 100 times in one second so the light would appear to be flickering at a frequency twice the supply frequency of 50 hertz that is at a frequency of 100 hertz whereas in America, Canada and Mexico with a supply frequency of 60 hertz it would be appear to be flickering at a frequency of 120 hertz